Welcome to Module 4, Lesson 9. Today we're going to be working with fractions and whole numbers again. This time we'll be doing it to convert units of measure. I'm going to do it both with uh, just with the arithmetic and also with the bar model. Um, the first problem here, I have 5 sixths of a year is how many months? So if I were to do this with a bar model, I had a bar that was one year. We also know that that is equal to 12 months. And uh, for 5, 6, there's my 6. And I want 5 of them. There it is. And that's what I want to find out. So uh, 12 months divided by 6 equal parts is 2 months per unit. I have 5 units times 2 months per unit. I'm going to get 10 months. The other way to look at this is I have 5 sixths times uh, one year. I have 5 sixths group of a year. That's the same as 5 sixths groups of 12 months because 12 months is the same as a year. Now I have 5, I have 12 groups of 5 sixths. I can cross reduce that, divide that by 6, I get 1, divide that by 6, I get 2. And then 5 times 2 is 10 over 1 equals 10 months. Same answer in both cases. Here we have a nice little word problem. Mrs. Lang told her class that the class's pet hamster is one quarter foot in length. How long is the hamster in inches? So um, again, if I do a bar model, And I know that uh, there's one foot, which is also 12 inches. And I know my hamster is a quarter of that. Um, and that means 12 divided by 4 equal parts equals 3 inches uh, per unit. And I only need uh, one of those units, so my hamster is 3 inches long. Another way to do this is I have uh, one quarter group of one foot, which is one quarter group of 12 inches, because a foot and 12 inches are the same. So I get 1 times 12 inches over 4. I can divide top and bottom by 4. and I get 1 times 3 is 3 inches over 1, which is 3 inches. Same answer, either case. And that's it for today.